As technology grew, national armies expanded their dominance to the high seas, engaging in an arms race to perfect their naval forces. The Spanish, British, and French powers were at the forefront, locked in a constant battle for supremacy. In this video, we'll be counting down the top 10 naval war films you need to see. Master and Commander, The Far Side of the World. Kicking off our list is the exceptional Master and Commander, The Far Side of the World, directed by Peter Weir. This film provides an unparalleled glimpse into the Napoleonic Wars, as we follow British Captain Jack Aubrey played by Russell Crowe and the crew of the HMS Surprise on a mission to hunt down the French privateer Archeron along the coasts of South America. Stay off to us. Let's fly! What sets this movie apart is its dedication to authenticity, capturing the essence of naval warfare like no other. Through unconventional tactics and clever thinking, Aubrey and his men continuously out with their French adversaries, creating thrilling battle scenes that keep audiences on the edge of their seats. There's Boot. Coming in at number 09 on our list is the remarkable film Des Boot. Set during World War II, this gripping tale takes us on a harrowing journey into the treacherous world of submarine warfare. Follow the crew of U-96 as they face the perils of the Atlantic Ocean. <laughs> battling not only enemy forces, but also the unforgiving depths below. With its immersive storytelling and incredible attention to detail, Des Boot captures the claustrophobic atmosphere and psychological toll experienced by submariners. The Hunt for Red October This thing could park a couple of hundred warheads off Washington. Nobody'd know a thing about it until it was all over. Once more, we play our dangerous game with our old adversary. Coming in at number 8 on our list is the Cold War classic, The Hunt for Red October. Directed by John McTiernan, this gripping naval thriller, based on Tom Clancy's best-selling novel, captivated audiences upon its release in 1990. The film follows the Soviet naval captain Marco Ramius, portrayed by Sean Connery, who plans to defect to the United States with the advanced nuclear submarine. Red October, CIA analyst Jack Ryan, played by Alec Baldwin, discovers Ramius' intentions and must convince the U.S. military of the captain's true motives to prevent an allowed conflict. The hunt for Red October skillfully weaves a tense and engaging narrative, alternating between Ryan's race against time to gather evidence and Ramius' high-stakes evasion of Soviet forces in the Atlantic. Dunkirk At number 7 on our list, we have the widely recognized film, Dunkirk, directed by Christopher Nolan. Released in 2017, this movie showcases Nolan's commitment to practical production, delivering his most ambitious project to date. Set in the early days of World War II, the film depicts the dire situation faced by the Allied forces trapped in the town of Dunkirk, as the German Blitzkrieg closes in on them. Divided into three stages, Dunkirk unfolds through the perspectives of soldiers on foot, civilian ships embarking on a rescue mission, and the Royal Air Force providing crucial air cover, while character development may take a back seat. I'm not going back. If we go, they will die. You're weekend sailors, not the bloody Navy. You should be at home! The film's focus on the crucial channel that separates the British troops from salvation creates a sense of urgency and obstacle that drives each storyline. From the limited flight time of Spitfire fighter pilots to the perilous sinking of a UK destroyer, every moment is filled with tension and the constant reminder of the ticking clock. Dunkirk stands as a masterwork, not just as a naval combat film, but as a thrilling depiction of a rescue operation under immense pressure. Crimson Tide 
There's trouble in Russia. So they called us. And we're going over there and bringing the most lethal killing machine ever devised. Coming in at number six on our list is Crimson Tide, a modern submarine thriller inspired by the tensions of the Cuban Missile Crisis. Directed by Tony Scott and released in 1995, this gripping film takes us on a suspenseful journey as we follow the crew of the USS Alabama facing a potential nuclear threat. In this intense tale, a group of ultranationalist Russians is suspected of planning a nuclear attack on the United States, forcing the commanding officers aboard the USS Alabama into a moral dilemma. Captain Frank Ramsey, portrayed by Gene Hackman, with his vast combat experience, clashes with his executive officer, Lieutenant Commander Ron Hunter, played by Denzel Washington, a more analytical addition to the force. As the rising tension escalates, the film delves into the dynamics between these two commanding figures, exploring their conflicting perspectives on how to handle the situation. Against the Sun I gotta put her down before we run out of fuel. Prepare to ditch! Against the Sun takes us back to the challenging days of World War II, offering a poignant and straightforward narrative centered on the struggle for survival. The film follows the remarkable true story of three Navy airmen, Harold Dixon, Tony Postula, and Gene Aldrich. In the Pacific Theater, their torpedo bomber runs out of fuel, forcing them to ditch their aircraft. Stranded in the vastness of the ocean, the trio must rely on a small raft and each other as they battle against the odds. It's not anybody's fault, right? It's gotta be somebody's fault. I don't understand how you couldn't raise that carrier. Their desperate fight for survival unfolds against a backdrop of looming threats, including the constant fear of capture, circling sharks, dehydration, and numerous other dangers. Against the Sun effectively captures the essence of their story, evoking a profound sense of isolation from the very beginning. Black Sea Last year, I went out to the Black Sea. We found something. One of Hitler's U-boats is just sitting on the seabed. Coming in at number four on our list is Black Sea, a gripping and intense film directed by Kevin MacDonald. In this thrilling tale, we follow a sea captain and his crew on a daring mission to raid a sunken German new boat rumored to be filled with gold reserves. Assembling a diverse group of English and Russian sailors, they embark on a perilous journey aboard a Foxtrot-class submarine off the coast of Georgia. However, as tensions escalate and greed takes hold, the pursuit of riches leads to catastrophic damage, trapping the men in a race against time to escape their crumbling vessel. We gotta take him down one by one. Yes! Don't close up the door! Against the backdrop of geopolitical struggles, the conflict seeps into the confined space of the submarine itself. With Jude Law delivering a compelling performance, Black Sea offers a gripping narrative that explores the consequences of greed and the moral complexities faced by the characters. U-571 Everybody fall in, now! What's going on here? Hell if I know. Gentlemen, it's our turn. In the last great war. Claiming the number three spot on our list is U-571, a gripping and action-packed World War II submarine film. In this fictional tale, American forces embark on a daring mission to infiltrate and capture an enemy U-boat to retrieve the valuable Enigma machine. Led by a stellar cast including Matthew McConaughey, Bill Paxton, and Harvey Keitel, director Jonathan Mostow delivers intense action sequences, stunning visuals, and a palpable sense of danger as the rival submarines clash in the vast expanse of the Atlantic Ocean. Incoming! Die, die! The key to victory rests with nine men. When they realize what you've discovered. The film provides a thrilling and exhilarating ride from start to finish. However, it's worth noting that U-571 faced criticism, particularly from the British government at the time, who deemed it disrespectful to the memory of those who served in the conflict. 
Additionally, some controversy surrounded the portrayal of the Germans, who were depicted as ruthless aggressors rather than taking prisoners. Nonetheless, U571 remains a gripping war film that immerses audiences in the high-stakes world of submarine warfare during World War II. Greyhound Into your hands I commend myself, my body and soul. Amen. At number two on our list is Greyhound, a gripping naval war film that offers a unique perspective on the battles at sea during World War II. Unlike other films, Greyhound focuses on the crucial role of merchant ship convoys that supplied Britain throughout the war. Tom Hanks delivers a remarkable performance as Commander Ernest Cross, whose mission is to protect the convoy from German new boat attacks. The film immerses us in Krauss's intense journey aboard the Greyhound, we have hits directly on the convoy. The wolf bag's haunting us. You both starboard bound! Where every moment is filled with tension and the constant fear of devastating torpedo strikes. As the fleet of 37 ships navigates the treacherous waters to reach Liverpool, we witness the ferocity of the German assault, showcasing the immense challenge faced by the Allies encountering the advanced technology of the enemy. Tora, Tora, Tora. <laughs> Celebrating its upcoming 50th anniversary, this epic masterpiece continues to captivate audiences with its authentic portrayal of one of history's most significant events. From the escalating tensions between the United States and Japan to the harrowing surprise attack on Pearl Harbor, the film meticulously recreates the sequence of events that led to that fateful day in 1941. What sets this movie apart is its remarkable attention to detail and historical accuracy capturing the perspectives of both the American and Japanese forces. The film's stunning action sequences, captured entirely on camera, immerse viewers in the intensity of combat on both land and sea. That's it guys. If you like this video, kindly give it a thumbs up and make sure to like and subscribe to the channel. Thank you.